Hello, this is Victor. I'm here with a new product review, and this time I want to share with you the Legends of Nagash book. So this is the book for the Death Faction, uh, recently launched together with the Malay Importance. So let's see what is inside. So it is a total. It has about. Let me check. I don't see the number of pages. Hundred and twenty pages. Okay. Uh, we have uh, all pages are full color, nice quality, satin finishing. Okay, the content we have the first part that is the the background of the army. Then we have what is the a little bit of showcase, and we have a long part of the rules as of page 58 is all about rules. So there's quite a lot of rules here on on this book. Uh, here we have nice uh, new artwork for the uh, Legends of Nagash and yeah, we have here all the fluff I will go fast on the fluff but you see very nice artwork combined with the text I think it's the, the it's very very well done we have the explanation of the different units and what they are about and the different sub-factions I will say inside of the death uh, the different type of uh, on death and then we go to the showcase. Here we have some nice paint jobs and showcase of the miniatures. There were no new miniatures for this book. Uh, it's quite, uh, yeah, uh, maybe we were expecting some new miniatures, but there were no new miniatures launched together with this book. Here we have the heavy metal. Okay. And here we have some um, uh, paint splatter. Uh, to show how to paint, especially how to paint skeletons, how to paint zombie flesh. So it's quite interesting, quite um, it's nice. I like a lot this one this tutorial here to explain how to do freehand. I think this is quite interesting to see how with the small uh, easy steps uh, it's not that difficult to make a nice looking um, banner. We also talk, they also talk about the dive world. So we have uh, how to do spirits. So I think it's covered quite a, a wide thing, uh, quite uh, the most critical or most important things on the on death. Uh, then we go to the rules part, that is called Death Ascendant, and we have first uh, the rules for the death faction, and then we have uh, alliance abilities for the Grand Host of Nagash, the, the Legend segment, so we have uh, sub uh, alliances inside of the death, the Legend of Blood, so we have different Allegiance abilities inside uh, the Legend of Night, and then we have the Lords of Death. So we have here the magic, uh, we have the, the Soul of Light, Allegiance abilities, uh, uh, the Death, and then we go to uh, a battle plan, two battle plans, and the Path of Glory. Okay. Here we have the Path of Glory with the roster page. Uh, and then we go uh, to the War Skulls. And here in the War Skulls, we start with the War Skull Battalion. The first is a Nagash unit of Morgas and three units chosen from any combination. Okay, and then we have, um, yeah, we have here different, different uh, Battle Skull Battalions. It's quite somebody and then we have all the different units starting with Nagash, uh, the Lord of the Undead. They have changed how the in summoning goes in death, so there are new rules uh, here, so this is really changing how to play death. And we go to the end, so we have here all different... Uh, I think they create a new unit from the Mortis Engine Coven Throne, I think there is a new option now, if I'm not wrong, it's called the Bloodseeker Palanquin. I think it's this one, yeah, I think it's this one. And then we have uh, the different units here, okay. So, this is what you can find inside of the Battle Tomb of Legends of Nagash. And of course, at the end, we have the points for all the Battle Tombs, for all the Battle Squall, sorry, for the Battle Squall Battalions and for the different units. Nice book. If you play Death, I think it's a nice, it's a nice thing to have. And yeah, and yeah, no, leave your comment. Let me know what do you think. And as usual, thanks a lot for watching. And now, bye. bye.